Hello guys and welcome to part 8 of Let's Play Minecraft. I bet you're thinking to yourself, oh my god, this man has the sexiest voice I've ever heard. It's just making me melt. I completely agree with you on that because I do have an extremely sexy voice. But getting back to the point, which honestly there is no point, we're going to go to the entrance of this here banana cave, or so I have deemed it, and it is night. So actually that was completely pointless going there. <sighs> Once again, pointlessness. I think, uh, from what I have read and what I have heard, if you hear creepy music like that, that means you're close to a dungeon kind of thing. So, I, honestly, I, I would not be surprised at all if there was, like, a, a dungeon or a monster spawner or whatever you want to call it. And I, I seriously already got lost, so... Good job, Dylan. You already got lost, and it's only been about, like, less than a minute into the video. But I am going to show you what I have done down here. It is pretty amazing, if I do say so myself. Alright, so, right down here, down here, up, okay, okay. Alright, as you can see, I put a little wall right here against the lava, and I bet you're wondering, why would you do that? Now, a couple of logical answers should come to your head, like, well, because he doesn't want to fall in there, or two, because he's planning to do something amazing. It is both of them, actually. As you can see, I paused there, because I was trying to think of a very amazing word, but I could not. Uh, as you can see, I made a little step right here, so if I have something I don't want, like, say, this... Bam. Completely gone, and I don't want that. So I thought that was pretty handy-dandy. And right here, I made a little sign. And, you know, crouch. And, uh, I think that just perfectly fits what we're going for. I made a tiny little base right here, and I made little switches so when I step on them, the door is open. I'm just like a lazy American. I'm so perfectly amazing. Uh, I made a little workbench, I made two stovey stoves, and I made a chest, and... Also, I wanted to point out that, yes, I said crystal instead of diamond last video. Don't hate, people. Don't hate. Before we go any further in this video, and hopefully I do not, you know, slur my words together like a drunk, I want to give a huge, huge shout-out to a Mr. Cody W. I'm not going to give away this person's last name, because honestly, I don't know if they would like that, and if I did give out your last name, probably a thousand people would try to rape you, for obvious reasons, because they heard me say your name with my sexy voice. Oh, it's so sexy. Oh, I'm sorry, I'm entranced by myself. <laughs> I kid. I, I kid. Obviously. <laughs> Anyways, this user donated an amazing... $30 to my PayPal account to help with various equipment like microphones, cataclysm, all that good stuff. Currently I'm setting up for a new microphone because this one is not bad, but I would like a, a microphone that does not sound like shit. Like I, would, like I did that. So thank you very much, Cody, for donating to my PayPal. It means so much. I love you, man. And uh, this entire episode is dedicated to you. Heart, 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 hug, hug, hug. There you go, my friend. Now, that I've gotten that out of the way, that amazing, amazing person is so amazing, uh, I do not have... Okay, actually, I have what I want. We are going to make a couple of things, but unfortunately, we're going to have to smelt them. So while we are smelting them, we're going to go this way. We are going to explore, and what the... Okay. I was about to say something extremely inappropriate, but I stopped myself because, you know, there's kids watching this. Don't want to upset the children. Oh man, I am a little scared here. Torch. Torch. Alrighty, there are a, a lot of guys down there. Once again. Okay, yo! Yo, don't be shooting at me, yo. That's not nice. You don't shoot at people. I mean, honestly, if you were out on the streets, you know, rocking your. 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 T Whoa! What are you doing there? Whoa! 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 You bastard! I hope you enjoy a painful death. Alright, so, because I am not an idiot, well, I'm not completely an idiot, I brought along Cook Ham, and somebody will get an amazing sexy shout-out if they know who this character is. This is my favorite character from anything. Like, seriously, I absolutely love that character. So, it, the first person to shout that, or not shout that out, wow, smack in the face, Dylan, you're already failing. The first person to put that in the comment section will get an extremely sexy shout-out. That is, that is even more insane than a sexy shout-out. So, hopefully you're looking forward to that. Now, 
Before I decide to wait until basically 13 minutes into the video. Oh yes, also I have I have these these iron axes, steel, iron, something like that. Before I wait until the very end of the video, I am actually going to jump into the random comment and the question of the video. We are going to first do... Seriously, get out of my way, Gravel. We are first going to do the random question of the video, which comes from a user by the name of The Mighty Somi. Amazing name, I absolutely love it. This user asks, which is sexier, water or lava? And now, my mighty friend, just like the mighty kids meals that they have at McDonald's that do not make you feel mightier, or was that Burger King? No, mighty kids, yes. Yes, you see how they, they had M, just, you know, mighty, McDonald's. It's so perfect. I never realized the genius behind the marketing of a clown. I love that clown. Does anybody else here, like, literally hate clowns? They're not, they're not funny at all. They're just, they make you want to kill them. Or am I the only one that feels that way about clowns? Because I have a feeling that I'm not, but I would just like to get a little bit of reassurance on that. And hopefully I'm not the only one. Uh, as you can see, we have come to a little, uh, little circle here, and it is not very safe around these parts. This is what I like to call the hood, or the ghetto, as you white folk call it. No, I am not white. I'm obviously black, or Mexican, or Puerto Rican. Probably the latter, because Puerto Ricans are fucking badass. Yeah, I said a bad word. I bleeped it out, though. I made it all right. So, you can see a little Mr. Creeper. Yeah, this is getting kind of... Okay, that guy wants to be dead. We are going to go back here. But my friend, you want to know which is sexier, water or lava? It's... It's it's very difficult. It's like asking what is better, fire or ice, which basically it's the same. Honestly, I would have to go with water. Lava might burn people, it might kill people, but the only thing lava can't do is it can't bring people together. And that is, that is the reason why I don't like it. So, that is that is why... That is why water is sexier. Alright, well I don't know how to make a bucket. So... Somebody tell me how to make a bucket, please, because I honestly do not know how. And I know this reflects badly upon my Minecraft skills, but I am sorry, I just do not know. Let's go out this side. I do believe that we should go exploring down here, because this, this just looks cool. That does not look, okay, actually that is very safe. Hopefully we do not die going along the streams. Oh my god, gold! And I know gold is like completely worthless, but you have to understand. This is, hold on. I hear footsteps. No, no, I definitely hear footsteps. Oh god, they're getting louder. Alright, well I got my gold. That's all I wanted. That's all I wanted, damn it. Well, that was a waste of time going down here. But let us go back up the waterfall. Because then we have to go to the comment of the video. I was not 100% sure as to where to put this in either comments or questions. But I thought, wow, those guys are angry. Alrighty then. I decided that it would be better in the random comment of the video. Hey, you. Every time I go here, I get a little bit of a lag spike. That's kind of weird. Uh, anyways, the I'm actually going to have to. Ooh, hold on, we're gonna we're gonna kill this this hoe. Whoa, whoa, whoa! No, 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 no. No! You can't bring me down. Anybody remember that song? Ew, okay. Well, we're gonna go up here to bypass Mr. Skeletor. Skeletons are not nice. They do not like me. And, hello. Oh my god, I'm already out of torches. Alright, that's good enough. Now I actually have to pause this video for this amazing comment that is brought to us by the user by the name of Scottish Skater 93. Yes, there are a lot of S's in your name. 
His random comment is, As I watch this video, all I could think about is exploring your cave and letting you play with my creeper, because my creeper needs a hug. You may be thinking to yourself, though, Hey, Mr. Ryan, why can't you hug your own creeper? Insert creepy winky face here. Well, Mr. Banana Pie Lord, only you, who is the true hugger of creepers, can truly hug my creeper. Anyway, long story short, I want your body. Oh my god. Oh my god, the penis is like watermelons. Now, if you are a sane human being, you are probably smacking yourself against the head with a banana. And it has to be a banana, because if it's not a banana, you're a racist schmuck. I believe that is the first time I have ever used that word in my here video. But yes, <laughs> that, that was amazing. So thank you guys so much for leaving your comments and your questions. Feel free to leave your comments and questions in the comments section below. And I seriously need to figure out how to make a bucket because I want to make a bucket. Because I'm probably going to come out here. I'm going to take that water source. And why did I even go outside if I'm just going... To... Just follow along with me. I, 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 I tend to have a point, but it takes quite a while for it to get across. Now, it will be very nice if I do not die whilst going down here. Right here, I'm going to put the water source. I'm going to, have it, I'm going to let it go all the way down there, so I can ride this waterfall all the way down to my little banana cave. Now, if you're anything like a banana man, which is what we all strive to be, obviously, you want to see me go on a water slide. And actually, I believe a good bit of people have said that. And did we go this way? I do Oh my god, I'm out. This is kind of sad. I'm actually out of coal right now. I, I need to go back. I feel strange. I always make fun of having so much coal, and I, I don't this time. I feel... I feel like someone has touched me. But not in the good way. The bad way, man. Uh, but seriously, guys, thank you so much for watching my videos. I have officially hit 1,600 as of today, and that just, that is so awesome. Uh, seriously, thank you guys so much for that. And look at that, I now have a butt-ton of coal. Wait, don't, don't acknowledge what I just said. Torches together, my friends. I dare say that that is enough torches to help us explore a little bit. Because we only have... Oh, whoa, whoa, someone's trying to kill me. We actually... Oh, okay, yeah, see? Look at that. I, I gotta figure out what's doing that. But anyways... Uh, I went... Over here? I think I went... Yes, 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 here we go. Well, there is a lot of coal over there, which we will be getting later. Probably in episode 9. Stop it. <laughs> Cave is ginormous. I know what you're all thinking. Have you abandoned the banana fort? My friend, how could I ever abandon something with... Again, a dead end. Every time I find something that looks promising, it always leads to a dead end. Wait. Do not deceive me. Do not... Uh, oh, oh, wait. You did not deceive me. Whoa, what is this? This is looking pretty cool, I'm not gonna lie. Down we go. Do ho! Oh yes! All my efforts have finally paid off, and by efforts I mean randomly wandering around hoping to find something. Uh, the good old days. You know, honestly, I don't even know what I'm talking about anymore. Just, just, I, I hope you don't mind my name dribble. My name dribble. I always love it when people say that word. Well, it looks like we have come to a crossroads, but I'm going to let you guys go. I will see you on part 9. Thank you so much for watching this video.